I got my first climbing shoes and I went to my mom for the first time today. There are a lot of people at this party, it's weird, but yeah, so I'm going to do the story later. I don't know why, but these feel much better on this foot. I guess it's because people try them out. The lace pattern is just so weird. Well, they're on. <laughs> I have never used this before. I don't know what I'm doing. No, officer, this is not what you think it is. I guess that should do it. I don't know. There's something wrong with my shoe. I mean, with my but I think it's just my foot. Well, you guys, I am happy to report that rock climbing is much easier, except it's so painful that I don't even have time to think because I'm literally just trying to get off the rock because it's so painful. That was terrible. I did terrible. I, I, I was doing some stuff there that I shouldn't have been doing. And... It was just awful, like, and the only the reason is because it was so painful. I guess just wait for it to change, wait for it to get better. But I got further than ever before, like, I was able to go further than ever, like, I almost did the traverse. It's just so painful. Like, it just. I mean, it's not as bad as the other ones. Like, it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. I extra clipped my nails, okay? My nails were clipped and I extra clipped them. Why is one foot. A problem and the other one is not a problem. I don't understand. Okay, I'm gonna do it fully barefoot this time. They're taking a break. It feels better now actually. I feel like it's just bearable. It's like it's almost to the point where I could bear it, you know? But it's like really bad. This is ridiculous, okay? Because this one doesn't hurt, but the other one does. Actually, it hurts more when I pull the tongue out. Park is closing. I've got to go. I am in pain. So I'm headed somewhere else because I've got a real question. How does anybody climb in, in, in climbing shoes? Because, you know, I see how amazing they are because you can hold on to the wall very nicely, but they just eliminate so much of 
the ability to just use your foot. I feel like I feel like I can barely use my foot now compared to before. Like compared to before I felt like I could use my entire foot. Now I feel like my use is restricted. It's just maybe it's just the pain, but I don't know. I just feel like I can't bend my foot, you know. I can't use a little part of my foot like I don't know it's just so weird uh, yeah they're they're feeling much better uh, I'm getting used to them actually which I didn't think was gonna happen but my feet are actually throbbing right now <laughs> Which I'm not sure if that's supposed to be happening, but they are... Actually, my left foot is throbbing more than my right foot. <laughs> uh, this uh, limestone is a uh, chalk limestone. I just ran my first 5k. I just ran a 5k for the first time ever. I've never run that far, maybe when I was a kid, but now I am going rock climbing. So today I'm going to test out, I'm going to break in my shoes. This is day two of... My hand is so tired. My arm is so tired. This is day two of breaking in my climbing shoes. But before I do so, I need to take a break because, yeah, I just ran 3.33 miles, which is crazy. It was 3.33, but yeah, 3.33 miles after riding my bike to the start of this location and now I am here going to keep on breaking in my shoes so let's do it look at how sweaty I am look at my legs I have never sweat this much in my life <laughs> oh my god it's literally dripping off me I have never, like, I've never sweat this much, but... <laughs> the park smells kind of like pee. It smells weird, you know? It probably rained. Oh, fuck. Oh! I just got bit by a mosquito. I was, uh, once again bit by a giant mosquito. Oh, shit. I can hear the flies. And, um... Unfortunately, there was so much blood that I screamed like I was being murdered and I rubbed off the blood with some dried grass. <laughs> My hands are definitely sweaty. I feel like Maybe I should have this separated into a smaller bag. my knee on a piece of rock that was sticking out. Yeah. <laughs> it's so painful though, I cannot, I can't like, it's almost unbearable to be honest. It's just really bad. I think because I'm using them more this time.
was wrong. Oh, hey! Oh, shit. It, <laughs> day number two, I would say it's getting better. I'm getting more comfortable with them. They're starting to feel like, yeah, I could be using them and using my brain. They don't hurt as much as before, so I'm able to use my brain more. I feel like I'm getting there. I'm getting used to them. Alright, uh, so... I don't know. Whoa, there are these two lizards and one of them is doing like a territorial dance. It's my rock, not yours. Get off my rock. <laughs> oh no, there is a red ant. Oh god, oh lord. Good morning. I just ran 5k again. And, uh, back here again. Getting ready to climb the rock. millionth time not the millionth time but you know time day number three breaking in my shoes yay all right i gotta say something so it rained last night or this morning and i just slipped on the rock and i almost fell and oh my god look at the inside of the shoe it's wet so I just want to say um, look at how slippery it is I just want to say um, it's something to be aware of yeah um, that was very scary I would have probably like rubbed my face on the rock which would have Hey, so it's been a couple of days, maybe two days, I think. Um, I just did my morning run, and now I'm back to do uh, day four of breaking in my shoes. Last time I didn't record because there were some people nearby, and I just felt weird. Um, park is less full of people today but there are still people but I feel like today is a better day to record so I'm gonna record a little bit just to have it in the video and um, yeah God, you guys I um I might be actually losing my hair all right so it's time for my update so this is um the fourth time I believe I think I should have tightened this one a little more, but it should be fine. Um, so fourth time, um, I will say the pain that I felt um, right here is gone. Um, oddly enough, I feel like my right foot is tighter than the left. I think it's because I laced it up less than the left. I shouldn't be doing that, but um, the grass is not wet today. So I should be good on that, and um, yeah, let's just um, let's just do this and see what happens. See how much it hurts. I mean, it's getting easier. You know, it's it's, it's getting better. It's just um, it's tough. You know, I think the main thing is when you get to the top, um, you have to like step down. It's kind of like a little downward slope at the top, and anything that's downward just feels like death <sighs> like seriously death <laughs> My arms are beat. <laughs> um, I had to rest a little bit. And my toes are hurting once again. So 
I think today I did more than I've done in the past couple of times that I've been breaking in these shoes. Um, I'm very happy with today. Oh, there's the- Oh, no! Oh, no, sir. You shall not pass. You shall not. It was an ant right there. Well, I'm very happy with my progress so far. And I feel like the shoes are becoming easier and easier to wear. Um, that last part of rock that I did at first, it was just painless. It was great. And um, I think part of it is that, so I tend to use the tip of my foot. And because I'm using the tip of my foot, I'm getting more pressure at that area. And that's the part that hurts. And I found that I could actually use my heel, which is something that I haven't been using in my climbing. I've tended to use the side of my foot and the tip of my foot, but I haven't used my heel yet. And I used my heel for the first time. Um, maybe I'll be able to pinpoint that in the video. And wow, that was, that was really good. That was like very supportive. I felt very supported with my heel, like very, very supported. So Hey guys, so I just ran and I pulled a muscle on my thigh. I came here to the park to climb, but maybe I shouldn't because I don't want to hurt myself further. And um, yeah, my face was like 10 times redder than it looks right now. You know what? It won't hurt just five minutes five minutes and that's it. This is a bad idea. I'm like telling myself that this is a bad idea, but I'm not going to listen to myself because I am stubborn. You know, it's just a small pain that will probably get worse if I use it. <sighs> Fudge nuggets. Okay. Fudge nuggets. I'm going to do it. Five minutes. I'm not going to put too much pressure on it. It's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. Wow. Someone literally went full out and took a huge dump. I don't know if it was a dog, but that's like five days of fucking shit right there. Someone literally must have done that shit on purpose. Are you seeing this? Okay. Are you seeing this? There are flies on it. Like, how much fucking shit? And you know what? There was a, there was poop on the bridge, too, when I was running. It smelled like poop, and when I looked, there was a whole bunch of diarrhea. Rule number one when climbing is don't get cocky. Um, and we'll spell from there. I had no idea what I was going to do. I was panicking in my brain. I was like, oh my god, my hands are going to give out any second. I'm going to fall. Ah. All right, so no more pain. Pain is gone. Actually, I'm feeling a tiny little bit of pressure, but... Um, that's it. I guess that's it, man. They don't hurt anymore. It's only been like six, maybe seven, um, short little climbs. And, uh, yeah, uh, this is great because I was worried that they would hurt forever, but they don't. So I guess... That's the end of my video, because they don't hurt anymore. 
watching and if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this try to testing videos um real real life guys this is real life this is um someone pooped near the rock but yeah <laughs>